I splurged a little bit today. Welcome to our Airbnb. I am freezing. Day, I hit 10K followers. Hi guys, and welcome back to the vlogs. I know I said I was gonna film Vlogmas for all of December. I pretty much did about up to the 18th, I think, and I just got super busy. My sister came, it was just a whole thing. But we are here at Whistler for three days, and I thought, why not start off the new year with a Whistler vlog? I think every year I have a Whistler vlog, but I haven't gone yet. And I haven't gone snowboarding yet either. So super excited. Well, happy new year if you're new here. My name is Julia and I'm so glad you are here. I splurged a little bit today for the new year. This is Dana. Um, and I got something. So I thought I would just do a little bit of unboxing. We have to leave in like literally five minutes. So I'll show you what I got. This is my first Dior purchase. It was, I wouldn't say it was impulsive, but kind of it was. Like I was wanting something similar. Wow, I didn't, I didn't see your package it, so. I got a Dior belt. Um, pretty much I got these jeans a few days ago and they were just way too big and I don't have any belts. Like I don't have a single belt. And I think it's just a nice staple to have in my wardrobe. So I got the one that's reversible and it's, this is the logo. There we go. Yeah. So I will show you my outfit. We are headed out for dinner today. We're here for two nights, three days. We're here on the Monday, January 2nd, which is when I'm filming this. We are snowboarding tomorrow on the 3rd, and then, no, tomorrow's, today's the 3rd. Oh no, today's the 2nd. And then I will also, so I'll vlog the next few days, see what we get up to. Also be nice to show you um, the new year and my new routine and all of that. I will film an updated workout routine, week of workouts and all of that in a few days when I'm back. This Airbnb is also so freaking cute. I am going to have to show you guys a room tour when we get back because we're in a bit of a rush. But just to give you a sneak peek, there's this huge mirror. Let's get ready for dinner and head off. And this is a belt that I got on. I'm in love with it. It's perfect for these jeans just because they were so big around the waist. Um, but I love it. I'm in love. Great way to start the year. And now we are off to dinner. We are going to this place called The Raven. The Raven Room in Whistler Village. It's about, about a 10 minute drive from here, so we should probably leave in a little bit. I am excited. I think they're kind of known for their cocktails with a little bit of like food. I don't know, we'll see when we get there. But we are off. I will take my phone. <laughs> I'll take my phone and I'll film with my phone because I don't know how busy it's going to be there. However, tomorrow I'm going to get lots of footage for you guys. It's just me, my sister, my dad, and then maybe our priest <laughs> coming to ski with us. So it'll be pretty smaller group, more manageable, and able to film more. Yeah. Welcome to our Airbnb. This is in Creekside Village and I just want to show you a really quick tour because it's so cute. So you walk in, um, to the left here we have a closet and a bathroom. It's just a, just a half bathroom I guess, half, because there's no um, thing. There is laundry and dryer. And then to the right we have kitchen. We're here for two nights, three days, so we're pr pretty much going to cook all of our meals here. Very cute. Actually a really nice Airbnb. And then we have the, I don't know if this is a master bedroom, but very cute small bedroom in the downstairs floor. We have the living room. I'm obsessed with this huge mirror because it just opens up the space so much. Um, and then there's our living space. I actually really like this too. So we have this living area. We have a heat um, fireplace. A little seating area. And then also we have a small deck or balcony. Maybe I'll show you the view tomorrow morning. But it looks oh, I think there's a view. pretty much the village. 
Um, and I don't think that's our pool, right? No, that's no, different. But we have that. And then it looks into the master bedroom. Take you upstairs. There's these really, really cute furry steps right by the door. So I think upstairs is what like makes this place so much cuter. We come upstairs. And what it looks like. So starting off with this area, this is like the second living room, perfect for like, I guess, just like movies, kids. I'm assuming this is a pull-up bed, um, so we could technically have a couple more people. Honestly, it'd be nice to come like with the six of us, like, yeah. last, like last year. Also, if you haven't watched our Whistler vlog from last year, go watch that because I think that was really funny. So we have our own closet, and then we have this nice bathroom. The floors are heated. Yeah, this is where I guess the whole family will be showering because there's only one shower. And then the bedroom for us, and then this is um, the bedroom that Diana, Diana and I will be staying in. But yeah, I think this area will be so cute. It's in Creekside. Maybe I'll link it if we can ski find it. Ski in and out. Oh, it's also ski in and out, uh, but it's on the Whistler Mountains. So we're just going to tomorrow morning ski out, take the Creekside Gondola, take the Peak to Peak over to Blackcomb, and then start a ski trip, which I'll show you tomorrow. It's a lodge and there is a communal hot tub, steam room, sauna that is connected to this little area which we're gonna check out tomorrow. It's already 10 p.m. We finished dinner. So good. We went to the Raven Room. It was, I would say like a solid four out of five. I think the portions could be a little bit bigger. A four out of ten. Did you try your toothbrush? Oh. <gasps> what? Because you brush your teeth later. <gasps> I did it back <laughs> you're, not you're not using my toothbrush. I brought a toothbrush holder and no toothbrush. Yeah, I was going to say it, but you were brushing your teeth when I was like looking. So I was like, oh, she's probably going to pack it after. Yeah. Chip. I'm going to buy one. So that was our little cute room tour. I hope you enjoyed that. I'm actually really excited. It's my first ski season or no what does that mean like my first time this season snowboarding whereas Diana snowboarded is it your fifth time sixth, sixth time so I'm kind of concerned because if you follow me on Instagram you will know that my toe I injured my toe on Christmas day from dropping a speaker on it and it's still a little bit bruised and if it hits like different areas it does get a bit uncomfortable I'm just kind of worried that the boot will be a little bit uncomfortable with it, but what can I do? I book, we booked this months in advance. Got it to work. Brush my teeth. Brush my teeth? Yeah. Why? Yeah, because it brings the toothpaste on Oh. So hard. morning it is the next day it is bright and early it is about 8 a.m. we are pretty much ready to head out if you know Whistler it is an 8 to 3 kind of place so you need to go right when it opens um, it is a ski and ski out resort so we probably can just go straight from here with our snowboard stuff out to the lift take the gondola up that's my dad again now this is my fit I just need to put on my snowboard pants and my snowboard jacket what I'm wearing is a turtleneck, I think it's from Aritzia. Um, this is a Uniqlo Tech Fee Sasha Jason's, and then I have the Montec um, sweater on top for bottoms. I'm just wearing my Gymshark. I think these are the Adapt Marl. I don't know actually, these are actually really nice though. I'm wearing these, um, two layers of socks, and then I'll share you, show you my jacket and my ski pants once I put them on. We are all ready. This is my final look. I am right now freaking sweating. 
but it'll keep me warm on the mountain. This is her look. All white. Mine is all black. And we're off. I'll film on my phone. And I'll see you guys in a bit. We are on the gondola. I don't know if you can hear me, but we're, this is the gondola that is really close to our. Oh, you can see yourself. Um, really close to our Airbnb. I'm um, afraid she can't see out the window. It's all foggy. Getting tired of the waiting. You gotta wake me. Open my eyes. Cause I'm feeling now we're fading. I'm in a daydream. Show me. We are still at Whistler Mountain. It is around 10.30, almost 11, and I am freezing. That's all I have to say. <laughs> I'm freezing. Um, but we're right now on a Harmony ride. Harmony Express. Harmony Express. Is this peak? Peak or peak? Peak or higher than peak to peak? Yeah, higher than peak. We're going nearly to the top. Oh. We're nearly to the top. But it's been fun. This is my fourth run. We are probably on our last couple runs of the day. The peak to peak and all the lifts close around 3 p.m. So we want to make sure we make it over to the Whistler side because there's two mountains here, Whistler and Blackcomb. And we have to go down the Whistler. So probably do maybe a couple more. Mm -hmm. And then um, once we get over to the other side, we'll just ski or board slowly it's down to back. our... Last run. We could um, we could touch base with the. Uh... We are back at our Airbnb after a full day of snowboarding. It is 4 p.m. I think we can all agree if you snowboard, the best feeling after snowboarding is taking off your helmet, your clothes, and jumping into comfy clothes. Honestly, not bad for my first ride of the season. <sighs> but it was really tiring. My toes felt like it was like getting squished my pinky toes. We're headed off to the hot tub. Honestly, we are all so tired, but we kind of have to for recovery purpose and also just to say that we did it. But we're so tired. Oh. I wish they had one like in our balcony. Yeah. some ice cream and chips so we're going to the market that's right across from our Airbnb gonna get some snacks and my hair. <laughs> I am so tired oh my gosh I don't know if it's because of my first round of season or maybe I'm just like unfit is it this no but my oh my I am so tired oh this is so cute here cute little village I don't 
What I was saying was, I am so tired. My eyes are barely staying open and it's only 7 p.m. So I'm hoping, are you going the right way, Nana? Something's in here. I don't know how to get here. It might be up here. I'm so tired, so I'm excited to go home with my snacks and just pass out while watching a movie. Yep. Yeah. Good morning guys. It is the next day. It is a third and final day here at Whistler. We're on this very beautiful but cold scenic walk before we drive back down to Vancouver. It is so cold. Today is like the perfect weather uh, for snowboarding. It's super sunny and blue skies, but we are heading down back home. We have a lot of things to do at home as well. I have a lot of work to catch up on from just being here for three days. So I'm excited to just get back into a routine as well. Also very exciting, but today I hit 10K followers on Instagram. That's been a big goal of mine this, I guess, yeah, since starting my Instagram page and we finally did it. And it was my goal for 2022, but honestly, we're only four days into 2023. So I feel like I can say that I hit it for the year. Um, but yeah, I just wanna say thank you so much. If you follow me over on Instagram, if you don't, I'll put it right here. Go follow me, go show me some love. And yeah, I'll, let me show you this view. If you made it this far, thank you guys so much for watching. Stay tuned for next week for another video. I love you guys and I hope everyone's having a great start to the year. I will see you next week for a new video. Bye. Oh, and don't forget to subscribe if you haven't. Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And for real, I'll see you guys next week.